Okay, so on this question, it's saying it wants us to determine the um, horizontal and vertical intercepts for each graph below. Okay, so um, intercepts must be written as ordered pairs. Let's look at this first one here. So I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to put in the intercepts. So we're talking about this point right here. We're talking about where the graph hits the grid lines. So that one, that one's hitting at zero, zero. And that's both the vertical intercept and the horizontal intercept. You remember, you got to put parentheses and a comma. And so in other words, that one goes through the origin. And that means that's where it hits the, that's where it hits the vertical line and that the vertical grid line called the y-axis. And that's also where it hits the horizontal grid line called the x-axis. Now, the next one hits here on the vertical. So what's that point? That's over zero up one, right? It's one, two, three, four, five. So that's over zero up one. And then it hits here. What is this? Well, this is um, back one, back two, back three. So that's back three up zero. Remember the first number is sideways, <clears throat> you know, over, and the second number's up. So it's back three up zero. So that point's back, whoops. That one right there is back three up zero. That's where it hits the horizontal. Okay, and now, on this third one, look in here, it hits right here for the vertical. Now, um, what is that point? Well, you can tell it's 10, 20, 30, 40. That's, that's over zero up 40, isn't it? That point right there is over zero up 40. Now, where does it hit the horizontal axis, the x-axis, the horizontal intercept? It doesn't. It does not hit it, does it? So um, what, are we gonna, what are we gonna do about that? Well, what, what do they want us to type in? Do they want us to type in DNE or something like that? Let me see, I'm gonna go to the homework system real quick here. Yeah, that's what it says, type in D and E. Does it, did it say it up here? Oh yeah, there's, yeah, I didn't read the fine print. Here it is, if an intercept does not exist, write D and E. Thank you. So yeah, this one is D and E because it does, that stands for does not exist. Does not exist because the horizontal intercept does not exist. It doesn't, it doesn't hit the horizontal intercept, does it? Here's the horizontal axis, here's the line up there, they don't touch. I'm making sense. Whereas the vertical, it hits the vertical axis right there at 0, 040. All right, now for the last one. Uh, this one hits right here. This is over 0, up 10. That's where it hits the vertical, over 0, up 10. And then it hits right here. Now, what is that point? Well, you can tell the jumps are going by 2 on this one. Can you see that? This is negative 2. Right there, this one's negative four, negative six, and negative eight. And then over there is negative 10. So that's the point back eight up zero. Back eight up zero is where it hits the horizontal axis. And so there we go. There's all four of them.